everyone, this is Tammy, and I have some happy mail. This is from my friend Lilac. Isn't this beautiful? I love how she did the envelope. It looks so pretty. Yay! So let's see what's inside. Oh my goodness, I think it's a pocket letter. Oh, how sweet and cute and kind is that. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, have you guys seen this? Look how cute this is. Oh, I feel like I dropped something. Ooh, I don't know where this went. Oh, I dropped two of them. Darn it, those are cute. So this is really cute. Let your light shine. This says, thank you, Tammy. Oh, it kind of looks like they came in there. Um, this is beautiful. Look, it's like a silhouette or a cameo. And here's some washi samples. Some pretty doily with some rhinestones. This says, capture the moment. This says, dream big. This is so pretty. This says faith. And the sweetest memories are those we share. Lilac has always been super sweet. She, oh my goodness. She's, she listens and pays attention and then does something for you that's a surprise and it's awesome. I bet she's an amazing mom and wife. This is beautiful. Oh, look at this beautiful beautiful like a thread I don't know what it's called some sort of twine but it's pink and look how cool it is I'll take it out here in a minute this is a note yay and there's a little clock that says happily ever after with a beautiful dove goodness gracious okay so if you guys aren't familiar with pocket letters oh I love this envelope what they are is you <laughs> You make a little bitty like scrapbook almost in each page or each pocket. So they can each be different or they can be similar. They can have a similar theme, kind of like this kind of gives you a same feel. Some people will put random things in each one. I mean, I don't know. It's really kind of cool. So this one has some washi on it. That's very pretty. And the paper is gorgeous. There's like glitter on it. And the same with this one. And I kind of leave the stuff where they are. I look at it, but then I leave it where it is. And I have been bad at using it, but it's, you're supposed to use it. Like, you can use this on whatever you want to use it on. If you want to, you know, make a pocket letter for somebody else and use this washi to line the page or whatever, that's fine. It's, that's what it's for, but it's hard to use it, so we shall see. Oh, this is fun. There's, like, little sequins. Or sequins? Is that the right word? Yes. There's little sequins in here. I don't know if you guys can see, but oh my gosh, they're hearts. You can see it through the bag. And little dots. Aren't those cute? And I love this kind of paper. Love it, love it. And then she gave me a T. That's, oh my gosh. Look how cute that is. That's a clip. That's a T. And then here's just another random piece of paper. She probably used this in my, like it's probably from one of these. Oh, I think it matches this one. And so what you do is like if it's a little extra, but you might, I mean, it's pretty. You know, I might be able to find something to use this for. So you include this kind of a thing too, which I think is awesome because I will find something to use that for if I decide to use this. <laughs> Only because I love having it here too. But what I'm going to do, and um, I've seen other people do this, and I know that my friend... Um, Robin and Robin's Nest does it is you take them and you punch holes where the holes are over here if there aren't already holes but usually with these little baseball card things there's already three holes so you just punch it if there's not a hole like the washi doesn't have one here so I would punch one here but then they fit in a three ring binder and then you can kind of remember where you got them and you can look through them and it's just kind of fun so I'm going to do that I haven't done it yet but I'm going to and I'm going to leave this in here, although I will say I will use this because I love that. I don't know what I'm going to use it on yet, but I'm going to find something soon. I 
I love the sound of that. It's so cute. And then, let's see. And this one there is this little frame. Isn't that cute? And you don't have to put something in every one, but that's kind of what a lot of people do. And I love how she did the double doilies here. You see that, how she did a doily here and then a doily here to make a little square that fits over. And this is gorgeous. I love this. I don't know if it's on its own thing. Yes, it is. This says, from the heart, and it is a heart. And Oh, I, was just, I don't know how she did it. It's on a brad. Isn't that cute? I love this. I don't know if she made that. Did you make that lilac? It's gorgeous. I love it. The only reason I'm asking if you made it because it's similar. I don't know. It's probably not the same, but it's kind of. So in this one, there is this twine. Oh, I have to use this too on something, something really special because I love it. Maybe one of my Prima dolls. And then in this one, oh my goodness, I'm just going to take out, oh, it says thank you, Tammy. This says once upon a time, and then here's all these little pieces and pops. Oh, triangles, those are cute. Oh, here's a star. Look at that triangle. This is pretty. These are so cute. These are adorable. And then there's a little a chipboard sticker that she put on here and just says for you. And I'm still not sure if that these were in there because I see that they're kind of bending. So I'm going to move them out. And I will put them in the top one so that I won't bend them. Oops. You go in there. You go this way. You go this way. So then this one has this beautiful cameo picture. I wasn't sure if that opened because it looks like it might, so I thought I'd better take it out and see. And then here's a piece of uh, paper. Oh, I love this, it looks like a book. And oh my goodness, this one is mermaids and they're kind of chubby. That's awesome. And then, oh, look at this. So, oh my goodness. She looks like she stamped this owl. And then on the inside are these beautiful velvet trim. Oh my goodness. Look at that. It's so pretty. Oh, it's a bird. And there's a key. And here's some dots. So cute. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is so cute. I love it. I think I got excited and didn't put this back right. Or maybe it was like this. There we go. I'm crazy. And it's cool too because baseball set cards are like two and a half by three and a half. So you can do something really cute in just a small space. Oh, that's from the envelope where I cut it open. Okay. 
Okay, and then in this one, <laughs> so that's a Brad. And this looks like a sticker. I'm not going to take that one out. So this one has a Brad that I can use. This Dove is a Brad. And then this one has the little clock and the lace. And this looks like a Brad, too. I'm going to double check. Yes, indeed. That's a little Brad, so I can use that. And then this one, oh, no, this one, I think, said note. Yes, a note. It's like there's hidden compartments in here. It's so cool and fun. And that says Faith. And it's that mermaid paper. Super cute. Isn't that cute? And then her little note. Isn't that sweet? Oh my goodness. Aww. Oh my gosh, Lilac, you are so sweet. I am so happy that I helped you in any way. You are an amazing soul, and I appreciate you. So cute. Goodness gracious, you're going to bring tears to my eyes, girl. Thank you very much. I, I appreciate you. I really, truly do. You are a sweet, sweet soul, and... I can tell you that it's not me that's that's helping you. It's God is doing it and you are allowing him to. So I appreciate that and I I really am just doing my thing and I'm so glad that it makes some people relate to me and understand and that's what life is about and goodness gracious, I'm so glad that I can help anybody every anybody. I mean anybody that is helped by watching me play with paper. I totally appreciate you or make a meal or, you know, just be me. I absolutely appreciate each and every one of you and know that you in the same context of me, maybe helping you bring you happiness or joy or whatever, know that you do the same thing for me. Cause when I started this, I wouldn't have done it I seriously wasn't even thinking this was something I'd want to do. I did it, and even my kids would warn me, Mom, you're going to get some negative comments. You better be careful. You're going to get negative comments. And I can tell you that the number of negative comments I have had has been so few. And please don't bring this as to something. But, I mean, it's serious. I, I can't even tell you the number because it's so small. And the comments that I get every day are just so wonderful and uplifting. And I really, truly feel like you guys are my friends. I feel like I get to know you. I think that you guys might get to know me a little bit more just because I'm the one that's usually, well, usually doing the talking. What a dingbat. I am doing the talking. <laughs> I'm the one that's doing the share most of the time. And all I get are the little clips that you guys put on your comments. But trust me, I feel like I get to know you guys too. And stuff like this makes me feel like I get to know you even more. So I totally appreciate it, Lilac. Not that I'm asking for anything like this. Please don't take it that way. But it's just so kind when somebody wants to share a part of their soul with me by making me something or sharing a word with me or whatever. It's just so beautiful. And Lilac, I absolutely love this. This is a treasure and I cannot wait to start my binder so that I can look at this. And I just absolutely appreciate you. And I can't tell you enough how much you mean to me. So thank you. And if I did anything at all to help you, know that you have also helped me. So thank you very much. Have a beautiful day, guys. Bye-bye.